All right, all right, all right. So today I realized that I have never done anything on 2K in regards to expansion teams. So I have added six NBA expansion teams. The Omaha Airmen, Bronx Ball Brawlers, Honolulu Breeze, the Vancouver Ravens, the Seattle Supersonics. I don't know why it just says Sonics, but we ball. That's good enough. And the San Diego Surf. Those are the six teams I've added. We are here at the expansion spot. And I've done stuff with it. I've done like stuff with the Sonics, but I realized that like if you look up Click Productions expansion, I have never done anything directly, you know, re related to expansion teams. So, yeah. And um, matter of fact, here are all the players that will be protected by their team. So I would assume that it'd be a pretty low number of players that are allowed to be protected. Um, but nonetheless, most of their teams protecting their most important players. But then you get 35 year old Brooke Lopez getting let go by the uh, Bucks. So I wonder where he'll be picked. The other one I saw that was very interesting was actually Philadelphia 76ers, Mr. Tobias Harris. And yes, this is a modern day um, league. So Victor's here with his haircut and uh, all that. Spencer Dinwiddie being let go by the Nets. Clay Thompson by the Warriors. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah the, the the draft will definitely be interesting. Jonas Valanciunas. Uh, did I see Christian Wood, Nurkic, John Collins, Gary Trent Jr. Yeah, I said screw it, Dre. Why not throw a? Uh, oh yeah. Also, I'm I'm live right now on Twitch. So uh, you know, what I'm saying I've been doing a lot of these videos on live recently. For the you know, what I'm saying if you're watching on YouTube right now, it's just it'll be on the description. And there you go, the chat back on the screen. So screw it. Advance past this. And go to the expansion draft. How will this go? First overall pick, the Ravens will select Brooke Lopez. And yes, this is a pretty deep expansion draft. Six teams. Clay goes third after Tobias. Jonas Valanciunas to the Airmen. Gary Trent Jr. goes fifth and Spencer Dinwiddie sixth. So those are the first few players I saw. Then John Collins will join Spencer Dinwiddie. Zach Collins will join. Why is Zach Collins an 80? Buddy Heel goes to the Airmen with uh, Valanciunas. Isaiah Stewart. Dang, can I like stop this? It is. Dang, Poku got let go. Jackson Hayes. Young man Jalen Johnson. Caleb Martin. Wow. Tough. Led the team in the finals for what? Isaiah Joe three-point shooting self. Al Horford old self. Josh Hart scrappy self. Th Taylor Horton Tucker. Adios. Two Mike Conley, Gabe Vincent. Mike Conley shouldn't surprise anybody. He also went super late, though. Like, Mike Conley over Isaiah, oh, after Isaiah Joe is kind of wild. I guess these teams probably aren't trying to win too much anyways. All right, we can start speaking. Oh, Dylan Brooks let go. Gary Payton the second. Is that Keegan? No, that's Chris Murray. Sorry, that's his brother. Uh, Jonathan Isaac, he's been doing a lot of other stuff anyways. So, hey, whatever. Malik Beasley. Who the hell is this? Onlurop bit bitim. I mean, Hakez got let go. Royce O'Neal, Yuta Watanabe, Jericho. He's a 76. No. Oh, snap. Was he the last pick? No, he wasn't. He was second to last pick. Brightney Lakina. Um, new legend of the Honolulu Breeze in the what's it called draft. All right, let's see. So basically, we're going to see. I probably want to see if uh, any teams can win any rings starting off from this. So here go them full rosters. And yes, I'm only controlling those teams. So it'll be pretty easy to navigate. Jonas Valanciunas, Buddy Heald, Isaiah Joe, TJ Warren, Delon right Dwight Powell matter of fact let me just see the lineup it's basically exactly what I just said oh they got Davion Mitchell too all right cool the brawlers they're gonna start Tyus Jones Gary Trent Joe Harris Jay Crowder and Al Horford um the breeze Gabe Vincent Karis Levert Tobias Harris Isaiah Stewart and Jacques Landale Tobias gets his uh back in Orlando basically the Ravens Killian Hayes starting at the one with Andrew Nemhard Jay Sean Tate Poku and Prime Nets Brooke Lopez or at least he'll have to try and be the Sonics Spencer Dimity Josh Hart Dylan Brooks John Collins and Charles Bassey. Honestly, not that bad of a team. Just put Gary Payton the second at the center. Um, Surf, Mike Conley, Clay Thompson, Jonathan Isaac, Caleb Martin, Nurkis. This is actually a really solid team. Ikez isn't even playing. Where is Frank at? What did Frank get drafted again? There, yeah, here he is. Yep, Frank in the reserve, sadly. Uh, we'll, we'll be all right. Perseverance. So that's really it. A beautiful little just simulation set up. Simulate. That's it. Hey, like I said, Surf, not bad. Surf, 10 and 4, 11 and 4, 12 and 4. Hold on, let me see. Who's trash real quick? Okay, 9 and 11 for the Airmen. They're actually kind of all kind of the up oh, frank's team is five and 14 six and 11 for the ravens the other teams are kind of decent they're doing let me see i already know there's nba teams doing worse than them and by the way yeah the the leagues are about to be bloated because that means three new teams added to each conference and you know what's crazy too i didn't want to just use all these default ones it only let me get the sonics in there but aside from the sonics like it started tweaking out and glitching when i was trying to add like an alaska team for some reason so i just added all the default ones in the two carity has jesus the wizards are two and 16 yeah jordan Poole is leading his team to a worse worse than what's it called oh and injuries are on by the way i honestly forgot i left them on but that's fine i usually do that anyways <laughs> don't go anywhere click i'm gonna get a snack hey the sir hey imagine we had a ring team year one. Oh snap an intense game between the omaha airmen and the, the san diego surf intense that leads with an omaha airmen w led by Jonas valanchunas and an all-around effort isaiah joe forget it mike conley that's the real goat dylan brooks is efficient that's how you know we're in a different timeline any all-stars from these teams 
we'd have to see Tobias Harris or Brooke Lopez probably. Um, no, hell no. Yeah, it's called an expansion draft for real. Well, I mean, shoot, you gonna get the bottom of the barrel type of players. You think Buzelli's is gonna be a bust, dog? I have no clue. How am I supposed to know that? I don't even know. Click is pizza good or bad? Sometimes I feel like I'm. I I got a kindergarten class, and Jokic wins MVP, Victor Rookie of the Year with the with the haircut. I feel like I always have to mention it. Marcus Smart with the with the green hair. Although I know the green hair isn't actually for because he was in Boston, um, but he still got it, and he's in Memphis. Um, Giannis, DPOY, Poku, most improved. JB, Coach of the Year, and Jacob Park, Executive. JB is the Cavs, right? Of course, they're always too good in these. Any expansion team players putting on for this world? I don't see any. Nowhere. They didn't even get any good rookies. Oh, man, my, my dog, Anthony Black, spring right toe. Oh, snap. San Diego and Seattle both in the playing game. And what about the East? Omaha in the playing game. Is Ja, like, injured or something? Because nope, he's playing. He is there. The surf will just barely hold on. You know I would have jumped him if it seemed like I needed to, but it was probably just free throws. Ja Morant, yeah, got smoked. And Memphis will head on to the next part of that. 23-point win for the uh, Sonics. And, yep, they, they smoked Cat, Edwards, and all them. I don't know what's going on, but these teams have superpowers all right now hopefully omaha loses because they're playing my, my beloved king um i was trying to think of a random player quentin grimes screw it i was actually like rooting for the knicks this whole time without even realizing it but hey it's, it's a close game nope it's over omaha will get the knicks out of here and so far every team has won nope the Sonics are not going to make the playoffs. They get smoked by the Grizzlies. That's tough. And matter of fact, while we're at it, let's check up how, on how the other teams did that didn't, you know, make it this well. Okay, so the Vancouver Ravens with this terrible team will have... What even is this, dog? Did someone get injured? Because this is... Oh, Brooke Lopez? What the hell happened to him? Brooke Lopez, first time eating roti, isn't expected to miss any time. Then why the hell is he on the bench? I guess, you know what? They were they were truly tanking. And then uh, Honolulu is also pretty trash. Sorry, Honolulu. Um, And then Bron the Bronx it was also a hey, we could say that again pretty trash i'm sorry i'm sorry all right so two seven seeds make it in i'm sorry no i just remember i went to coney island once as a kid and it was bro I, like you know i don't get about people roller coasters why do you want to go up there now this is a thing right too because i could do a roller coaster maybe built within the last 10 years but there's a roller coaster at coney island that's like known for being 80 years old and i guess to be fair at that point it's like well it is pretty tried and true i guess i just kind of contradict myself but it's so rickety and old that like dog i'm not trying to go up there and be the first one to be a casualty so me personally i'm gonna avoid that and it kind of stinks over there too so yeah that's really it and there's really no parking yeah <laughs> that's everywhere in new york city though um yeah the lakers are smoking san diego though i rock with bronx people though you know we got um oh now world renowned criminal kai Sinat. shout out to him um i guess because that's everyone i you know that i already know the agendas they're about to push from that from that thing is gonna be so terrible oh my god i hate the world uh we got Jesus and Mero from there probably like stefan marbury or something not uh probably who's that other dude sebastian telfair they're all from around i don't remember um yeah the the omaha airmen got smoked by uh, miami and the uh, san diego got smoked by la let's see you know who's really cooking for them when do you think they're getting out dog they're out they've been out why are y'all saying free them they, they, oh well of course buddy healed was cooking for the uh for the airmen oh and then the surf yeah caleb martin um who was terrible let's see clay thompson interesting well first year champion is gonna be the lakers versus the Celtics and the Celtics just came. Did they just come back 3 1? It was something like that. I think I think it wasn't. Oh, LeBron James is out of here. Hey, at least Dwight Howard got back in the league, though. Hey, Dre, hell no. I'm letting him go. See ya. Bye bye. Greg Popovich gave up on Victor. League meetings, draft lottery. Odds of obtaining a top three pick are based on the team's final record. What exactly are they saying here? Is it not already that? I like want to approve this, but at the same time, I'm really scared. Screw it. Let's do it. So you, are, you were saying it's like the NFL, no lottery, but I don't think that's the case. Damn. There is, oh my God, 20 teams in the lottery. So is it even a lottery? Wait, I added six teams to the NBA. Yeah, that, that's right. That's correct. Oh my God. Oh, that's why all those spots are always empty on the right side. Just in case that is hilarious i never even thought about that oh screw it let's see and wait no 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 no. watch it actually watch it watch it how the hell does this work i think i saw the first pick but i don't really care because like they all have even odds the sonics will stay at 20 oh god i'm not gonna talk unless someone moves up because it's about to take a year the thunder just moved into the top four from 18 oh the warriors have also moved into the top four from 14 which would normally be the last spot in the lottery hey not the honolulu breeze oh right, back to a roller coaster just while waiting for this um yeah when we went to vegas 
this this man Dom wanted to ride wanted to go on the roller coaster so crazy so much and oh the Wizards move up the Spurs move down to five and not one of us like we had like seven people that like came and went and not one other person so I'm happy it's not like an unpopular thought of why the hell would I want to go and go up on a thing that just goes around um Ravens okay they go four I mean I think I saw the Wizards get one right so the Thunder moved up from whatever to three and the Warriors get two so those are the two teams that moved up from like a millennia away so out of our teams though the Ravens have the highest pick with four than the Breeze than the Brawlers than the uh, whatever else I guess I have the draft in there right so Victor draft I think it's gonna yeah it says 2023 but Victor's already in the league so first overall Justin Edwards second Isaiah Collier fourth Zachary and the moment of truth the Ravens select Ron Holland number four okay DJ Wagner goes eight that's a beautiful pick to the Honolulu Breeze Bronx is coming up next they'll get oh why is his name Matt what happened to Matas hey gentrified me boy why'd they do this to him where did your name go that, oh no that's a great pick hey, wait, does that mean the draft is now 36 picks right yeah oh damn Bronny fell one pick short of the Sonics did they just sent him to Utah too oh Kyle Filipowski Thierry Darden that's a French name or something right how were their picks that late yo this draft is broken okay Filipowski th those those three went back to back those three teams and yeah the first round was 36 picks Xavier Booker technically should have been a second round pick but not in this not in this world what would you do if this was your last name oh wow the ravens drafted him they probably won't sign him Bronny is in next year's draft buddy we just saw him get drafted 3.7 seconds ago oh you mean like in real life yeah 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 he, he, i mean he could be he's in college so he it means he could leave college and go to the draft if he wants to shoot damn Kawhi got mad offers yeah so i don't even know i guess it's just a thing right so the argument towards actual expansion drafts, join, uh, expansion teams joining the NBA is like, oh, well, all the teams are becoming too talented. And also too, like whenever I do these Sims, it actually does kind of fix. I saw someone comment it and I'm like, wait, that's kind of a good idea to let expansion teams naturally like join into most of the sims i make because usually teams end up either too talented or they can't pay players so it's like low-key it's a good idea Kawhi leonard resigns magic get james harden i guess he just stood that last year and what's it called in philly the spurs take pascal so he'll be alongside victor lonzo ball will sign with the surf any uh any of our teams screw the rest that is the e easily the biggest signing yet for any of these teams okay i i literally see nobody else signing don't you guys have like all the cap space in the world Although, to be fair, the reason why teams got rid of, like, Tobias Harris is because, um, terrible, what's it called? Like, yo, they low-key might have lost some teams, uh, lost some players, too, because I do not remember them being this bad. So, Lonzo will join, actually, that pretty solid team with Yusuf Nurkic. These teams are terrible, though. I think they all, like, lost pivotal players. I just went, in, went to go type out the whole name of the draft class just from PTSD from the 83 to 23 sim. That is hilarious. I've been seeing a lot of Cooper flag propaganda recently, so I think we're still a grip away from a team winning a, a ring. We'll see that's what it was i seen that yeah cooper flag had supposedly cooked bradley beal in a 1v1 which is kind of funny i guess you know what's funny though is that <laughs> wasn't bradley beal the one that was talking to his camp that one year yeah and none of y'all and, and like being like real it was a good talk but like he was like and none of y'all could drop me off i could drop 40 on all of y'all like trying to like motivate them oh cooper said they never even played hey, i don't know oh it was brian it was scalabrini who made it up that's funny along with the simbi shoot until someone wins a wins a what's it called a ring lonzo ball didn't make an all-star team but julius randall did and brendan ingram you know his former teammates oh my god the grizz oh actually no 36 is fine i thought i didn't realize it was still mid-season how the team's doing all right the brawlers are 19 and 33 they're 15th in their conference the breeze are 21 and 32 they're 17th in their conference um the ravens are terrible the sonics are okay they're in play-in right now they're all pretty terrible yeah so it's gonna still be a little more time until we have a ring winner do you think that the nba would do playoff expansion if teams are added i, I was just thinking about that if they probably would make it more teams in the playoffs but how would you even do that i mean low-key that's literally the play and basically just maybe they would just no that's the thing though because you can't do 10 teams because then there wouldn't be an equal second round because there would it would be one team that doesn't have an opponent oh you said bye week never mind you're smart you're smart um dj wagner wins rookie of the year with what's it called with honolulu so 18 and 7 assists a game emmanuel quickly six man with the lakers a Kawhi leonard dpoi derek whitehead most improved in brooklyn and will hardy coach i think 
that's Utah. No, that's Memphis now, I guess. Still no play. Oh, Lonzo Ball, all defensive first. He averaged 22, 6, and 8. They got Lonzo to start scoring again like it was Chino Hills. Honolulu. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. A few rookies. So DJ Wagner, Mataz Buzelli's was second with 16, 6, and 6. Um, Ron Holland, 17, 6, and 2 with two steals for also a rookie first team uh, for the Vancouver Ravens. It was a random dude, Jazion Gortman for the Bronx Ballers. He averaged 10 and 5. He was undrafted. And Seattle makes the play in. And Omaha makes the play in. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Just sim just play, just simulate it. The Sonics, they both they both lost. John Collins tried, lost by 12. And uh Gregory Jackson the second, undrafted rookie, was trying to cook for the airmen, but they got smoked. Yeah, I threw I threw Omaha in there because I'm like, there is nothing else to do from Nebra in Nebraska, anyways. Tatum and Shea, finals or conference MVPs. And I think another lead was just blown. Yep, Tatum finals MVP again. This season, Brooke Lopez, John Collins. I'm trying to see who was like actually good for these teams that kevin herter leading them in scoring they are in hell jeff green the knicks retired i'm honored to be his last stop was that boogie cousins on the brawlers i just saw that yeah there's nine with them draft lottery this year any of our guys like number one or something uh the brawlers i really just wanted to see that long body lottery last year but i'm not about to do it again sonics via sacramento they finessed that one okay because they also only had the 19th pick let's see the sonics number one overall pick no 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 hold on don't tell me i swear I, I seen that correctly. Hold on. 20. Because if it was just their pick and nobody else's pick, that means this one, 19th, jumped from 19 to 1. This is insane. Yeah, I don't know why their logo is tweaking. Who cares? You could read, buddy. Yeah, that's insane. And uh, oh, the Brawlers got two. Where were they at? Brawlers were four, so that's more normal. And uh, the rest of the guys kind of got screwed. So, okay, top two, top two picks. Ace Bailey's ranked number one. Oh, and then Cooper is too. He's barely related to Amari by any chance. First pick, Seattle gets Cooper flag. There you go. And Dylan Harper goes too to the Bronx Brawlers. The Surf will get Ian Jackson. That should be an elite pick with how we know how he'd be moving. Dang, did he move down a class? Because I swear he was in the Brawny class every time I drafted, right? Uh, Raven's going to get John Bowl. 13th pick for Mitchell Robinson straight up. Oh, they get back to... Oh, they got Nasir Cunningham and Jaden Williams. Okay. Bryson Tucker to the Breeze and Jason Azamoda. Huh? All right, cool. Why don't you just comment, give two homeless men bricks and have them fight over a ham sandwich? What are you talking about? The hell are you talking about? Giannis is a free agent. Giannis, number one offers from the Ravens. Please lock that in. Please lock that in. Oh, Donovan, you can head to New York, buddy. Um, Yo, use your money, please. Giannis Antetokounmpo will head to Vancouver. That man is leaving the country. Good luck with that tax rate. We have a star inbound to, Va to Vancouver. They got him, Cole Anthony, and rookie or second year Ron Holland. Look at that, man. Look at what we've seen built. And John Bowl at the center. Yeah, he sure, he's a curse in 2K, but it don't matter. Donovan Mitchell to the Knicks. Kyrie will take Giannis's spot on the Bucks. Any other uh, expansion signings? Oh, the Sonics get Russell Westbrook. How is he in 85? I'm just being serious. How the hell is he in 85? Hey, that works for me, though. 36-year-old 85, buddy. You are barely sniffing 80 these days. But uh, Airmen will re-sign Davion Mitchell. That's really all they got, though. That's really all that's going on. How did Westbrook progress at this, at this old age? So uh, actually, yeah, let me look at this. Ravens, so Ron Holland up to an 83 with Giannis and Jordan Hawkins and uh, Westbrook. Well, now, oh, that's hilarious. I just realized he signed with the Sonics. That's crazy. He fulfilled the, the, the prophecy, but he got drafted by them. Then never got to play for him. That's crazy. Yeah, the hair is crazy. I don't know. Where, uh, they, they got everything old school going back on with Westbrook. So it's Westbrook, Cooper, Flag, Kelly Oubre, Terry Rozier, John Collins, Clint Capella. Then you got Lonzo with Dylan Brooks and Isaac. They might have the most inefficient team in world history. Matisse too, too. Yeah, they're about to shoot 30% for a team. Um, Davion Mitchell is just alone over here with Buddy Heald and Greg Jackson. Buzelli's is basically alone with Kevin Herter. DJ Wagner, Isaiah Stewart, Josh Christopher. Not a bad team, but he needs some help. But that Giannis team, eh, that Giannis team and that Westbrook team are looking kind of interesting. Man, oh man. Next year is Cameron Boozer. Now, chat, you know, that could be a big year. If one of our teams could tank real quick. Matter of fact, which team has Giannis? Yeah, make sure we're on them. And yeah, I don't know why the logo keeps on glitching like this. Yeah, the Ravens. I think I put the Ravens in the conference with the Wizards because it made me think of the Baltimore Ravens. So I just threw them over there. I was, I mean, with the division because I was trying to um keep them in the correct divisions in terms of like where they should be in terms of like actual location. But then I ended up getting too many teams in the same places. So I just threw them in random spots. Is 2K23 still worth buying? I mean, value your money how you sh how you shall, buddy. There's only like three weeks left. Do you come up with these teams? No, they're like when you when you go to 2K and go to add teams, they just give you default presets. Like 
I said, I wanted to have a, um, I know for sure I was trying to add an Alaska team and that was like, but then the thing glitched on me and I was like, screw it, bro. Just throw in the default ones. Hey, they just lost to the Bronx baller brawlers. What's going on? Ravens. What's going on? Giannis got smoked by Buzelli's. Come on, man. Yeah. He is really trash in this game though. My God. I heard that they uh, pay you to live in, in Alaska. Like if you have kids, they pay you for your kids to live in Alaska. Would you live there? Don't think so. Don't think ideally I would live in Alaska. Oh, you can go join Jesse Pinkman. Yeah, man. RP to that one dude to die from Breaking Bad. Margolis. Lamelo, MVP, Rookie of the Year, Cooper Flag, 19, 8, and 4 with uh, two steals, two blocks. Damn, that is a crazy sad line now that I think about it. Isaiah Collier, six man of the year with the Warriors. The Kawhi wins. The, why is Kawhi winning so? Oh, the roster. Now, they definitely made Westbrook a little bit too good. No, no hate. But um, the roster I downloaded definitely made it so that all these players do not fall off. I got to start downloading custom rosters more. Jalen Duran, most improved player. Mark, Mark Dane whatever the hell i forgot i forgot again this is the worst name ever i'm sorry this might be the worst name in human history dagnall or whatever yeah man why is a 96 is nuts what do you mean it's nuts what is he now like a like a 93 still like come on man what do, what do you expect him to be i mean I, him getting better is kind of crazy though yeah him getting better is kind of crazy but like he should in 2k like him and paul george will fall off to like a 77 in two and a half years Giannis makes the second team with his beloved ravens and um the surf uh, get lonzo all, all defensive all also, Greg J Gregory Jackson, all defensive. Uh, Cooper Flag and Dylan Harper, uh, one and two in the rookie of the year race. And Ian Jackson, dang, did they like nerf him? Because I swear he was like the best player in the class forever. The Ravens were the best team, tied for the best team in the league. Giannis's Ravens with Jordan Hawkins, Cole Anthony, Josh. Yeah, this is, a, this is a real solid team over here. Obi Toppin's over there somehow. John Bowles on the bench. They got Yurt starting. The Surf, though, were the worst team in the league. Lonzo's team was the worst team in my bad in the West. And the East, it was actually the Bucks after they lost Giannis. And even, even though they got Kyrie, did not matter. They were trash. Oh, bet Giannis averaged 22, 10, and 7 this season. And uh, his, his supporting cast is beautiful as well. Cole Anthony, cool little 15, 16 from Holland, 16 from Hawkins. Hey, I, you know, we got a prediction going in the chat right now. And majority of people think that Giannis will make it to the conference finals or the NBA finals. So uh, that's interesting because honestly, knowing Giannis, is his, this is a great team, though. This is a good team. Oh, it's Seattle. Look at Seattle. The Sonic led by Russell Westbrook. Oh, wait, what? They traded for DeJounte Murray? And that's fire because he's actually from Seattle or he's from, yeah, I think he's from Seattle. And he got traded. Mad time, I saw he got traded to Orlando. What the hell? Is that Isaiah Thomas? The Lakers signed the Isaiah Thomas? That is hilarious. They traded John Collins for DeJounte and a second round pick. That, the former teammates. That's funny. The hey, predictions on just Giannis's team, but both might be interesting. I don't know or not. Well, I guess we'll see. They're playing against Omaha. Omaha made it out of the play in. So it is just Davion Mitchell, Clay Thompson against the Giannis God squad. Kind of. They went from probably trash to. So wait, didn't Vancouver. Uh, I was trying to think of who they drafted this. Oh, yeah. They, they had John Bowl, I think, last year. So that was 10. Vancouver up 2 3 1. All right. So far, yeah, out of that, that, those woodworks. Oh, snap. Seattle in a game seven. And they got smoked in game seven by one point knowing that i wish i would have jumped in but i don't really care zion and cj smoked russell westbrook sorry westbrook sorry to jante vancouver onto the conference final so the chat was correct at least in this regard they are playing against the two-time champion boston celtics boston wins game one wins game two loses game three oh well, boston that is and down two three Giannis's team has lost in the conference finals you know what's crazy i think the chat yeah majority said he would make it to the conference finals and that's it so yeah i guess they were right smoked by the two-time champions and now and uh taylor hendrix was the finals M conference mvp i think brownie's in utah right yep there he is and the celtics three-time champions one of a kind jason tatum i guess al horford retired cj mccollum's out of here he just had to beat the what's the call real quick oh snap play thompson's out of here. He was tired of that team. Oh, he left. He left San Diego, went to Toronto. Yeah, I could tell he left because he wasn't on any of the rosters and then got traded back this season. He said, yeah, this is a sign. Let me get out of here. They had this man in what's it called in Nebraska. All right. The uh, Pelicans via Milwaukee have the number one odds, but the Breeze, the Surf, the the Brawlers are eighth. The Breeze and Surf both top two. Let's see. It is going to go to Miami. Wow. Mad teams jumped up. The Breeze and the Surf dropped down to six and seven. As far as they possibly 
possibly could actually that is very tough they are getting kind of cooked we got six what's it called six chances basically at getting a top pick and got none of them correct so they'll get co Pete. they'll get wow where where is cameron boozer there you go to washington pelicans traded that pick for Kyrie. no that's insane because they just traded the bucks pick back to the bucks for Kyrie, and that means the pelicans just added Kyrie next to Yon, next to zion sorry after cj retired elzai harrington bryce tillman who will the bronx get oh dang bryce tillman traded immediately jerron stevenson oh yeah yeah okay Derek queen all right i don't really care if you pass like 10 you're probably not gonna be that great i mean it's possible but who knows so i guess watch out for these two wait no that dude got traded i don't know what the hell that trade was for oh gotta make sure you sign your 36th pick oh hey key and anthony will go to the uh omaha he'll take clay's spot as of right now it's looking like Giannis firmly has the best chance of winning a ring although there's a lot of free agents this year is bryce in this draft and actually i do not yeah there he was he went to uh shoot i don't know he went to the spurs he'll join victor you're in the 2030 draft class like in the game or hypothetically like if you were to you would be in 2030 the jazz have signed steph curry what a sentence damian lillard leaves the blazers for the heat in free agency who would have thought in the game maybe are you like right is it we, we got it we got a hooper in the chat oh yeah and kd went back to the nets that is pretty funny oh he said nobody knows me yet uh, hey man maybe one day we will be drafting you in these sims you know what i'm saying oh my oh bam out of bio has left the heat for omaha that's the funniest part about the heat is that i believe they're uh they're what's it called i think their g league team is in like colorado so it's like you think you're living in miami and then you're just all the way up there and Chris Middleton has left Milwaukee rebuilding self for the San Diego surf. So a lot of the Ravens, wait, Giannis's team is going to get DeAndre Aiden piling up talent over there. They also get Malcolm Brogdon. I saw another one to the airmen as well, but there is a lot going on. Oh, Westbrook's starting to fall off. I mean, Cooper's up to an 83. DJ Wagner's up to an 87. They didn't sign anybody over there though. Buzelli's up to an 85. Harper. Oh, they got drafted. Oh yeah, they did get drafted together. Okay. Okay. I thought I was tweaking for a second. So they got Bam, Davion, Greg Jackson, and whatever over here it's, it's okay lonzo ball will have chris middleton join his team this was the worst team i believe out of all of them this season and ian jackson went up to a 78 i just seen a report that says mark jackson offered 1 million by an adult site to provide play-by-play -play. i'm deleting twitter i mean x i'm deleting x my apps don't update though i have it off so i, I mine still says twitter jesus the ravens are 39 and 8 yeah this is this is a super team oh yeah no they're probably dog they're insane this is how you do it whatever they did they got ron Holland whatever whatever overall pick i think he was like five or some four they got jordan hawkins undrafted goaded or was i on january 6 2021 you know it's funny you say that because i actually do remember where i was i went to go see my cousin and played some basketball go back to his house and uh um yeah there was a lot going on that day or was i on september 11 2001 i wasn't born yet so uh yeah sorry to disappoint you on that one actually though no i did tell this story right did i tell this story on stream or in a video about how my, my uh my mom was there september 10th 2001 a month before i was born okay it was in a video yeah because I, I think someone had re re rehashed that to me recently joel Embiid, most viable player marcus johnson rookie of the year amon thompson six man Kawhi, dpoy basala most improved lloyd cook coach of the year which is what team the ravens of course they got mike wen coaching the team trey luca jt evan mobley and joel Embiid are the first team okay Giannis makes the second team his ravens and nobody else look at Kyrie on the pelicans cooper flag and Giannis both make the defensive second team and the best rookie for many of them was Bue Fall. I think this is actually Taco Fall's brother I'm pretty sure I'm not sure whatever this dude that they drafted six was only was mediocre not the best although the Honolulu team is six in the conference and Seattle is two Vancouver is one Omaha is four mad contenders look at that but San Diego is terrible they're at the bottom of the conference they're like actually the one terrible team I think everybody else made yeah everyone else made the play-in or the playoffs so that is Alonzo Ball team being led to nothingness all right first round and the bronx brawlers eliminated by Giannis. Se seattle eliminated honolulu eliminated dang seattle eliminated as a second seed against the eighth seed or the seventh seed my bad De'Aaron fox porzingis flory badunga cam whitmore markel fultz led rockets uh get Corey kispert aj johnson Dejounte, russell westbrook and jared vanderbilt out of here and then honolulu loses in seven to luca yeah luca just got him out of here with uh with jalen green on the Mavericks dipped to a different team so now he's about to play his former team in the next round but yeah Honolulu with um Isaiah Stewart Tucker Filipowski I guess they're out of there and we're gonna have a second round matchup Omaha got KD and the Brooklyn Nets out of here Kyra Lewis versus Brogdon Jordan Hawkins against Johnny Davis
Davis, AJ Griffin against Ron Holland, Greg Jackson against Giannis, and Sabonis against DeAndre Aiden. When did Sabonis go there? I feel like I would remember that. He got traded this season. Didn't they sign somebody else? Did they bam out of bio in a lottery protected first for DeMontis Sabonis? That is the exact man. That is not going to help the debates. Um, yeah, you don't t check trades. Well, I usually don't have to check them. And speaking of that, they also traded Davion Mitchell for D'Angelo Russell. Oh, D'Angelo's injured or right, something like that. He's a little bit injured. Game one, Ravens smoke him. Yeah, I don't know if, if Sabonis can be able to hold the candle to Giannis. Ravens. Oh, this one's close, but it's not. Giannis, another win. Sabonis had 34, 10, and six. Definitely lit the candle, but I don't know if it's, you know, and Zachary got injured. Sabonis put it in the effort. This one, though, 20 point win. Sabonis' team had mad 20 point scores. They're going to bring it to 2 1. Home court advantage doing wonders out there in Nebraska. They got nothing else to do. I don't even know they're taking three hour drives to pull up to the arena. And look at that. Home court advantage cooked. It is 2 2. Sabonis 31 11 and 8. Ron Holland 33. What did Giannis do? I just want to see. 6 for 13. Okay, he had a good game, but, you know, a little bit quieter in the scoring. Omaha just cooked them in the. Y'all saw that chat, right? They just cooked them in the last few seconds there to take another win. And Giannis' team is at risk of being eliminated. He shot 3 for 10. Now, this wasn't a good game. 3 for 10. And he had, what What was that? 10 points? 6 points. This is a 3 0, what's it called? Run right now. 3 wins straight for Omaha. And Giannis is about to be eliminated in the second round by another expansion team. Only 7% of people, 77% of people said he would go to the finals. And 7% said this. So, y'all about to get yourselves a nice little bag. That is crazy. And links in the chat. What's a Raven to an Airman? I guess you're right. They are up there. Yeah, I guess you're right, honestly. Raven would get pummeled. Yo, it's 7 v 8 seed and 4 v 7 seed is crazy. Um, All right. It is Kyle Kuzma, Anthony Black, Justin Edwards, and the Wizards against the Airmen. I guess let's see. I'm kind of mad we didn't get any gameplay from that series. Oh, man. 1-1. One, 2-1. One. One, one. And that is it. Sabonis is going to the finals. The Monta Sabonis. Y'all was over here hating. Oh, they shouldn't trade Bam for him. Oh, my God. They might not beat Galaxy Opal Shea, though. Dark Matter Shea. I don't even know how OKC was the eighth seed. Smoked first game. Zachary's injured again. Chet is injured, though. Yep. Another win for the Thunder. Having a, a bad feeling it's over. That was... Oh, no. That wasn't at home. Thunder had a better record and got home court advantage. That's crazy. Because they were the eighth seed, and this team was, what, the sixth? Wait, actually, no. Yeah, wait. Check that again. Wait. Thunder were the eighth seed. Omaha, 46 wins. Thunder, 46 wins as well as the seventh seed. Oh, well, I guess they dropped down eight because they lost the game in the play-in. Yeah, it's over, though. It's over. Oh, never mind. Took a game. Let's see. Screw it. Yep, there it is. Shea wins finals MVP, and Omaha is out of here in the finals. So still no champion, sadly. Guess we're about to see next year. Robin Lopez and Brooke Lopez retire together and walk off into the sunset. Steph Curry's out of here. He got that one-year bag from the Jazz. Isaiah Thomas got released again. Steph Curry, Hall of Fame. Steph Curry, for some reason, that team retired his jersey. Change the number of fouls required to seven. Hey, I am with that always. And San Diego traded their pick to Indiana. Hopefully it's protected, dog, but that is terrible. And the Breeze finesse. You see the Breeze with two picks in the top 20 despite being in the playoffs. San Diego, please. Nope, they don't have a pick. That trash team traded their pick and it is gone and nobody jumped up. Honestly, I'm about to just simulate through the draft. The Brawlers got Wesley Hunter. The Breeze got some mid as well. Yeah, there's literally nothing going on here. That, that's that's a terrible. That might be the worst draft yet. So really, so far, we're figuring out is that the power is found through the uh, free agency, not the drafts or free agency and acquisitions and stuff like that. Shea has went to the Lakers after winning a ring, but he said, I'm going to go and enjoy some. I don't, I don't even know about warmer weather. I guess no tornadoes. Shoot, I don't know. Still got burning fires. KD left his one year in Brooklyn to go to Philly. He's taking the James Harden arc. Luca leaves Dallas for the Raptors. Any up? Uh, screw these guys. Any, what's it called? Sign? Okay, Trey Young joined KD. Jimmy Butler will stick around with Dame. Victor has left the Spurs for the Mavericks. Scoot has joined Victor on the Mavericks. Restricted free agency will be a little more strict, but that is crazy. Why couldn't any of our team? Hey, okay, Taylor Hendricks leaves Utah for the Breeze. So yeah, there's definitely no restricted free agent, but we ball. This seems already weird enough. Derek Lively to the Brawlers. Nick Smith to the Airmen. Westbrook led, left the Supersonics. Miles Bridges to the Breeze. Uh, pretty mediocre free agent class. Uh, well, at least for our teams. But hey, maybe these rookies are starting to take over the league. I don't know. Ron Holland is a 90. Um, Cooper Flag is kind of trash. DJ Wagner and Taylor Hendricks. That's a nice little duo with Miles Bridges. One second, man. I just got tagged in a crazy video on Twitter. And you know what's crazy, chat? I was thinking of doing something like this where, but th this dude is going to get a head start on the insanity. So some dude just tagged me in this video and it it's the dude in the chat 
that's me by the way rate my jumper bro this is actually treacherous this is not a jumper this is a stander this man has a 2k 14 set shot and he's and he's rotating this is not it dog no nah, it, it's you know what you look like you'd be a nice little fundamental um you could like get the rebounds that are like very open like nobody's contesting them like they just went out to the corner and you've been standing out there the entire time and like maybe hit two shots a game that's a solid that's a solid jumper it's not terrible you know the form is solid i like the follow through you really put the hand in the cookie jar i know it's off the screen now but i didn't want to have to torture anybody anymore feet ain't even squared no they are and that's actually the issue your feet aren't supposed to be squared that's a that's a myth y'all want to see a real hooper right chad this is a real hooper right here man i don't want to hear oh click you unathletic oh you suck i hate you buddy i am unathletic but i'm gonna still put ball in hoop though hold on off glass bang what are they gonna do about that like there's nothing really to do about that you know what i'm saying like that's really a that's really a ball and hoop man you know what i'm saying hey you gonna say oh click like you really can't do it to him with the little Luke. oh my god that is loud with the little luka Doncic step through off glass like come on now you know what i'm saying you know it's crazy too i've seen that one footer crazy someone said the crazy thing is i've seen people on twitter like yo bro what is that jump shot you go off of one foot buddy i did it on for fun like i just did it for fun then you know and i'm not gonna lie this is not my this was not my matchup i got a mismatch on this dude we didn't know who this dude was shout out to you if you ever see this i said oh yeah hell no he's like probably five five i said no i'm going i'm going to the post bucket you know what i'm saying all right and this is just a little string of and i hate people right a little you know what i'm saying uh what hit a three got it again i'm making cuts right now but you can clearly see the video isn't cut up this man meme takes and yes that's that's father meme by the way from all the videos from all the rec videos that's meme that's colby i don't know the rest of them but yeah that's meme with that terrible looking shot all stars i feel like this should be the year right except for uh what's it called except for Giannis, obviously is a free is a what's it called is, a, is an all-star damn nobody else though no other players what is taj gibson rank all time like two two and a half maybe you gotta give some room for uh, uh mark Sean Brooks at two. He could be two and a half. And then at three would probably be like, dude, I don't know. Kyrie won an MVP, by the way. Did MVP at 36? Yeah, low key. Yeah, he is 36. Wow. How did you know that? You got his birth certificate. 27 and 12 from Kyrie. Jamal McKnight, rookie of the year. John Fland. Flan. That makes me think of that Kerr is a Cowardly Dog episode. Kawhi, DPOY. Cam Boozer, most improved. And Lloyd Cook. That is Giannis's coach again. Ravens. Mataz Buzelli's makes the All NBA second team 21, 8 and 8. Yeah, I, it's kind of nice to see Kawhi cooking for the long term and Giannis oh you know Giannis was first team okay defensive first team Lonzo but it ain't really bringing them wins let's see actually oh San Diego they're in the play-in game look at that oh my god the Sonics what happened oh man post Russell Westbrook DeJounte Murray injured Cooper flag a bust yeah they are the worst team in the league so Honolulu's the second seed with a uh, DJ Wagner and Taylor Hendricks San Diego surf Lonzo Ball's team was the uh play-in play-in game and the Vancouver Vancouver Ravens, you know what I'm saying? Wait, what? Where the hell did Killian Hayes come from? 87 overall Killian Hayes, who's efficient with Giannis, Ron Holland, DeAndre Aiden, Malcolm Brogdon off the bench. Deion, they got every player. Is that Ben Simmons? Oh, if anybody fell off, it was him. He did not get better. He didn't have the Westbrook effect. Bronx Brawlers, uh, they are Dylan Harper, Maxwell Lewis, Matas Buzelis. They are the second seed, Derek Lively. They got it done. And then Omaha, the Sabonis team, the, the current reigning Eastern Conference champions are are back in the top four again oh dang the surf got eliminated in the what's it called in the predictions most people said the honolulu breeze will win the championship first they haven't even had playoff success yet hey maybe, maybe you're all psychic so i don't know i guess we'll see oh the bronx brawlers have been eliminated the omaha airmen have been eliminated in seven by the wizards so yeah sabonis's team will not be going back and bronx too wow they lose oh to jason tatum i don't know why the hell he's the seventh seed all right next round and they both make it honolulu and vancouver so vancouver now Giannis will get his shot against um against jason tatum i think again right i think they played once jason tatum Jalen brown no porzingis he left and then uh honolulu dj wagner bryson tucker taylor hendricks against De'Aaron fox and company we could have a finals matchup low-key that'd be a good way to like kind of cap it off they are both up 3-1 and it is 4-1-4-1 dj wagner chat wow that's actually kind of crazy these are the top two vote getters in terms of who people thought were going to win the ring first and they are up against each other in the finals killian hayes somehow he got 
got worse as the playoffs have went on. But uh, Giannis, Ron Holland, DeAndre Aiden against uh, Taylor Hendricks, DJ Wagner, and company. Let's see. They've both kind of just ran through the playoffs so far. Vancouver got kind of close against Washington, though. Is Frank still there on Honolulu? The Ravens are going to take game one. What the hell? Oh, I thought I thought nine points was the leading score. I was about to say 27 from Taylor Hendricks, 20 from Kamara. Shout out to Alvin. But they lose to Hawkins, Giannis, Brogdon. Just yeah, yeah. Giannis wins. Oh, my Ravens cooking. But wait, they're coming back. The Breeze are right there and they're not. And they are and they're not. The Breeze win by 11. DJ Wagner, 27, 11. Giannis, 25 and 11 with Killian Hayes with 22. Ron Holland with 23 all around efforts. It's kind of crazy that both expansion teams. It's been what, though? Actually, real quick, real check, real quick check. Because Giannis, so it's been, he was obviously on Milwaukee, but it's year five. Yeah, because it was 2022, 20, 23, technically. So it's year five. And are any of the original players still on these teams? I don't think so. Oh, Isaiah Stewart's an original one. Dang. Yep, there you go. There goes one. Isaiah Stewart's been on Honolulu for five years. And speaking of that, Honolulu will take their first win. In, led by Taylor Hendricks, 25 and 10. It's 2-1. Elzai Harrington is injured. That's tough. A close game, a two-point game to be exact. Um, all right, Vancouver has the basketball into Giannis. Giannis over to Brogdon. Pass down and wow, what a steal by Taylor Hendricks. Hendricks will go back up the other way. This is a nice court. I can't lie. This is a nice court. Kamara with the screen on the left for Taylor Hendricks. Kamara pass it down to Hendricks. Hendricks trying to body Giannis. He'll pass it out. He knew that was a bad idea. Tuck Tucker for three. That is good. Bryson Tucker will take a one-point lead. Uh, you ever watch Atlanta as a crazy random question mid mid gameplay but yeah I have actually passed down to Giannis and it is stolen but no it is not Giannis gets it back he'll dribble and go up with it and foul by Hendricks good defense but a foul shoot I don't know what else to tell you thank god the fouls are on seven now because he is one away from fouling out in a normal scenario Giannis at the line oh man brick super brick I forgot about this Giannis the second one and a, a make DJ Wagner the spin to the back oh my god how did he lose Malcolm Brogdon's slow body so with that slow body spin you know i guess i just answered my own question spin how where did you get lost in this scenario i'm so confused Giannis back up the other way guarded by miles bridges and Giannis will go left to the basket layup easy easiest layup of his life 27 percent field who had 27 percent field goal who was it oh my god he just lost brogdon again oh wagner four for 15 oh yeah no yeah he is that, his, that dunk was his fourth made shot of the game the screen though and he will pull up for three still confident and that is off he shouldn't have been confident 53 percent oh my the layup by his, I think that was Tucker, right? No, that's Jordan Hawkins with the layup. Jordan Hawkins, the spin, a, a second spin into the layup. He just confused the defense. Pass over and Kamara will pull the three. That is off, but the rebound by, I don't know whose ball it is. It's the Breeze. They still get it. Miles Bridges will pass the ball into Harrington. Harrington back to Miles. Miles passes down to Wagner. DJ around the rack. He will give it back out to Filipowski. Back to Miles. Miles Bridges with one second left will force a deep three and that is off. Don't think that was ideal. And Malcolm Brogdon at the line. The first is good. Vancouver can go up 3-1 if this game is... Hey, it's not over yet, though. A timeout and a miss from Malcolm Brogdon. Two crucial free throw misses from him and Giannis. He pass into DJ Wagner. 17 seconds ago. Wagner, the spin back the other way. He will... What the hell was that? And he made it? The hell out of here. 130-129. They are down by one with 12 seconds. They're going to force him back. They're going to force him back to the line. But he took a flight reaction type of shot. Brogdon at the line. The first one is off. Oh my God. Malcolm Brogdon is putting on display. A George Hill-esque display. The second one is good and they are only down by one. No timeout. It might have been a smart move to go for whatever the hell that shot was. Into DJ Wagner. Wagner with eight seconds to go. He, it's a, oh my God. DJ back out to Miles. Four seconds. Miles Bridges the step back. Another step back in the three and it is front rim and off. Oh my God. Miles Bridges. What was he doing? The hell was he doing in this game? Taylor Hendricks, 26. Miles Bridges, 12 on 12 shots. 5 for 17 for DJ Wagner. I don't know why he wasn't taking that last shot even still, but I don't know, man. 3-1 lead for the Ravens. Oh my. Breeze trying to make it interesting. They just went on a nice little run. All right, back in here again. Killian. Oh, this is a nice jersey. Okay, the, the purple ones are kind of crazy, but I like, the, I like the, uh, the Giannis ones a lot. Oh my God. He runs through that man. Hendricks could not guard 
at him. 111 to go. I guess you can say the breeze caught a second wind. I wish I had emote sounds right now because I for, I keep forgetting to re-download them. I hate you. Uh, Hendrix bullying up, bodying up, nowhere, going nowhere, back out to Tucker. And Hendrix will pull a moving three, and that is good. Hendrix deep in the back to tie it up. DeAndre Aiden, the pass will be into Giannis. Hey, just foul now. Giannis goes right. Giannis pulls up a close shot, and that is good. Interesting. DJ Wagner down by two, 33 seconds ago. Pass down. Wow, where was it going? I don't know, but Miles Bridges is wide open. 29 seconds to go, and they just left the man open in the paint. Miles Bridges on Giannis is actually criminal. The pass will go into Giannis. Miles could, did not try to steal it. Giannis goes right, stops, goes back, cross over. Terrible shot is good. Disgusting shot is good, by the way. Um, it was saying my mic was off for the video. I do not know how long that was off for. I am terrified. Either way, we ball. Wow, I do not know what I was doing. What? Was that even correct? Well, we ball. I'll just go another season. Hey, for the video, in case you guys are... Uh, what's it called? Post commentary? Hell no. They're just going to catch up. Game five of the finals, and DJ Wagner pulls up for three. That would have made up for it in terms of hype. Oh my God, what is happening? Killian Hayes, they want him to take the free throws? No, my mic wasn't off for that long. I'd be looking at it like every 10 seconds. So yeah, but yeah, um, shoot, it's 3-1. Vancouver up 3-1, and they are about to win the finals right now. That man, DJ Wagner, bricked the hell out that shot. As long as Killian Hayes doesn't miss his free throw, which definitely would not be on brand for Killian Hayes. Four-point lead, Honolulu with one more chance. Vancouver's about to win the first championship. I might go one more, uh, what's it called, season just for fun, and that is off. Yep, Giannis and the Vancouver. Chat, you really, hey man, I mean, to be fair, most of their advancements have came off of, like, every team's advancements have came off of free agent signings, but, like, it feels like cheating a bit that they got Giannis. <laughs> like, why did he go to Vancouver? Hey, right, we can give it, like, a year or two more and see if anybody else want to pull up and win a ring. I already know that that uh, DeJounte team is cooked, though. Hang on, I can't even see the presentation. My God. They call Vancouver the Greece of North America? What the hell is that supposed to mean, Kobe Bryant? Giannis, 29-11-6. and six. Jordan Hawkins, 25. Hey, they did make a lot of draft moves, though. If they didn't have Ron Holland, they would probably not be champions. So they also signed Aiden. They signed uh, Brogdon, who barely even played. That man Brogdon got crossed and taken out of the rotation. Giannis, finals MVP. Hey, screw it. Let's run it back for one more year at least. AD, Westbrook, Jimmy, Tobias, and Schroeder. A whole era is out of here. AD, Westbrook, and Jimmy. Eliminate the goaltending rule, and opposing teams will enter a 1 plus 1 bonus after 5 team fouls and a full bonus after 10. I'm with them both. Screw it. Draft line. Now, what, weren't they like terrible that one team so shouldn't they uh oh sonics yeah sonics are number one okay and we'll see uh screw it will they get number one hell no fell all the way to five fell all the way to five yeah we basically did just put in all the euro rules and some college and whatever oh who will the uh sonics draft man you traded a third overall pick for what patrick williams man Kyrie got traded for like six bryce curry a yeah, good combination of names to the uh sonics the surf got robert this draft is terrible is this even real like did i put in a no i've seen this dude before so it has to be dang lonzo's getting no contracts they've seen what he's led his team to oh he's about to get re-signed by the surf um the ravens re-signed ron holland the breeze Resign DJ Wagner. Sabonis resigns with the Airmen. Brawlers, same thing. Tyrese Proctor. Indiana to the Air uh, to the Airmen as well. Okay. The Surf get Isaac Amundsen. Nothing much interesting though. Ravens going back to back. I guess we'll see, man. Ma Mataz Buzelis is the most viable player for the Bronx Brawlers. Mataz, twenty three eight and eight a game pretty pretty impressive two steals two blocks uh Thierry Darden with the surf he uh 18 18 points to win six man of the year Kawhi is still winning DPOY Juan Nunez for the San Diego surf as well most improved player okay interesting Ron Hill with the brawlers with the coach of the year which is also just Mike Wang did they make every coach Mike Wang Matas Buzelli's Bronx brawlers first team did Giannis he made it over Giannis Giannis makes the third team Giannis makes defense Honolulu is the one seed the reigning western champion san diego is in the play-in game bronx is the one seed vancouver is the four seed omaha is the two seed and the sonics and some dude really put down bread on the sonics yeah buddy they are 17th did not make the playoffs and i think that's it everybody else at least made the play-in yeah it's funny that they were the worst because you would think most people want them to be the best also let's just see how the league is doing real quick Lamelo, victor john morant trenton flowers and tatum and points mobley and these guys and rebounds uh, harden and these guys 
Harden is on the Blazers. Of course, Victor's getting three and a half blocks. And that is one thing you can't hate, though. He did get like five blocks in both summer league games he played. Also, someone's got eliminated. Uh, San Diego's out of here. All right. Uh, and yeah, so Bronx and Honolulu both have jumped over Vancouver for the top seeds in their conference. And Omaha is also better than him, crazily enough. They all made it to round two. Bronx and Vancouver are playing each other in the second round. Dylan Harper, Mataz, and Vucevic against Giannis, Aiden, Ron Holland, Killian Hayes. Screwed. I'm, if it goes to a, like an elimination, I might jump in. Oh, Vancouver up 2-1, 3-1, and 4-1. Got the one seed out of here. The, the reigning champion said, screw it. Hey, we are still them. And we're about to see another matchup. Honolulu running through West right now. But Omaha versus the Ravens rematch. DeMontis Sabonis will get his chance to go back to back in terms of wins over them. And they win game one, win game two, lose game three. It's game five, a 3-2 lead, and it is 4-2. And that man Giannis will not be repeating. DeMontis Sabonis and a clearly worse team got him out of there. They had Sekou Dumboya starting with Johnny Davis start. And hey, Taylor Hendricks and them or, or DeMontis Sabonis is going back to the finals. So hey, that's crazy because 51% of people so that nobody would win this ring and it clearly cannot be nobody the breeze got 18 percent of voters and the airmen got one dude so uh that would be hilarious let's see if sabonis can do it the breeze win by 11 game one the breeze win by 31 game two I'm breezing through some pilots and why do all these things have to do with being in the air oh my god they are smoking them dog i'm sorry it's oh why do they always do this 30 point win by them after i said they were done for the breeze have won the championship nick smith went down down for the cause and uh sabonis yeah, i actually he lost too so that's tough you lost and you got a tour whatever he's like clay thompson rice and tucker cook yeah Yep, they cook. So uh, the Honolulu Breeze were the champions. DJ Wagner, Finals MVP. So we got two expansion teams to win rings. I'm not going for all six because some of these teams are trash. But hey, a lot of very competitive squads. Um, in the West though, San Diego couldn't make it out. That uh, I believe that's not. That's not. Is that Lonzo's team? Yeah, there he is. Two. Bro, Lonzo shot 0 for 11. Honestly, just send it off there, dog. It's been real. It's been fun, but it ain't been real fun. Shout out to everybody in the chat right now. Chat, say goodbye. I'll give you a second. Shout out to Killian Hayes. If you don't subscribe to this channel you will have the luck of a uh, playing game lonzo ball in the rim you'll have that type of chemistry with every person you meet for the rest of your life and it's been real it's been fun but it ain't even real fun times two and we gonna get the hell up and out of here cut